Driver visibility is a critically important factor when driving in all conditions. A faulty heater control valve can cause issues with the water flow to the heater matrix, which can affect the demisting performance of the interior heater, therefore impacting visibility for the driver. In this video, we test and replace the heat control valve on a BMW E46. This valve also fits several other models. With the vehicle in the workshop, raise the bonnet and remove the air cleaner assembly in order to gain access to the heater control valve, located on the left inner panel. The heater valve is controlled by the interior heater control unit. When the temperature is adjusted, the valve switches on or off to control the flow of coolant to the heater matrix. The valve has a two-wire electrical connector. One wire is battery positive and the other is negative, switched by the control unit. This actuates the valve inside to control the flow of the coolant. An oscilloscope can be used to test the switching function of the control unit. In this case, it proved to be functioning correctly. Before replacing the valve, drain the coolant from the radiator. Then, unclip the electrical connector, detach the coolant hoses and remove the old heater valve. With the old part stripped down on the bench, the valve can then be disassembled and inspected before fitting the new part to the car. The new valve can then be fitted in reverse order. Top up the cooling system with fresh coolant to ensure that it is bled of excess air. Then refit the air cleaner assembly. Start the car and allow the engine to reach operational temperature. Finally, carry out a road test to check for the correct operation of the vehicle's heating system.